election, first off, I really thought Donald Trump had no chance, and it just baffles me how our country is just full of such racism and bigotry and narcissism. And um, I am, yeah, currently I'm upset with the current situation of Donald Trump becoming president. Um, I believe he doesn't understand, you know, what America needs and what uh, the people of America want. Okay, um, I think it's really important to protest the results of this election. Um, and really, not because we hate Trump, which we do, but also because we celebrate diversity and the LGBT plus community and racial diversity and just, I don't know, man. Yeah, love Trump's hate. Man. Love Trump's hate. <laughs> feelings to it. I'm super supportive of students having a voice and having solidarity coming together and being able to experience passion and conviction and support for how they're feeling, um, trying to get their voices heard. They all recognize that they're not going to change the election, but their point is that they want to change how culture behaves and who gets a voice in power. Yeah, I feel very empowered by this movement. It's really good for everybody, including every gender, every uh, race. It shows that we're all together as one community and that we're spreading our love in a peaceful way, but a very powerful and uh, meaningful way. Well, I mean, these demonstrations are happening all over the like United States and everything, but I mean, yeah, this is definitely like, it's cool to see this happening around our home and everything. And it's cool to see people coming out and really trying to make a difference. You know, I've been really affected by like political art, you know, and I make it myself. And it, it feels like it's such a strong way of showing people your opinions without necessarily being offensive and violent. It's like, it's, just, it's a good way to express yourself, you know? The fact that we're out getting involved, teenagers are out getting involved in the politics and the democracy of our nation, that's what's going to change it in the future and that's what's going to make, you know, love fill our streets and fill our homes and that's why it's important to come out here. You know, the day after the election, I have a couple black friends and they were coming to school and people were yelling out their cars, calling them the N-word, which then forced them to have to go home for the rest of the day. Uh, that infuriated me a lot. I don't like Donald Trump at all. He's a racist, sexist. Uh, I don't like him. He should be our president. Show me what democracy looks like. This is what democracy looks like. Show they continue to follow through and that they move forward. I want them to contact their representatives. I want them to speak to their senators. I want them to talk to organizations that they feel will represent their voice. I want them to write letters. I want them to make phone calls. How are reactions making you feel? Really proud. I'm so proud of you guys. Honestly, I just, it's amazing. It's great stuff. We have a voice. Overall, I guess I'm really happy to see all of my peers um, who have the same opinions as me and who are willing to stand up for it. Right to be angry and come out and express that. So, good job, students.